Of all the drugs, fighting is by far one of the most addictive. It is extremely, the, the rush, the glory, being in the cage, the win, the defeat, there's just, as far as, it's a roller coaster. And it's fun as fuck. <laughs> oh my God. There's gonna be a lot of dense alpha male coming at this motherfucker. I wanna walk forward and hopefully put a hurt on him fast and, and set a pace. This time you might see me uh, flip the switch a little quicker. I'm always looking for individuals whereas we can snipe it out in the ring. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was bred for this. I'm about to put on one hell of a show for y'all. Back at it, ladies and gentlemen, for Shamrock FC 321. Jeremy Johnson along tonight with my partner, Adam Sella. It is time for our co-main event of the evening as Joe Perry takes on Thomas Thatcher. Kansas City, this is your co-main event. Anybody wants to see a knockout, let me hear a KO. Let's bring him out, Thomas Thatcher. It is time, ladies and gentlemen, for our co-main event of the evening. Coming to the cage outside of Lawrence, Kansas, it is Thomas Thatcher. Now, Thomas Thatcher is a former Marine Corps sniper. He is also a black belt in the world of Shitonru Karate. He says that he's gonna bring that traditional martial arts style in. He's been out of the cage for a bit, but he told me, he says that ring rust doesn't mean anything in this sport. Absolutely, it does not. It depends on how you train, depends on your mental uh, state, how you're doing. If you feel like you're gonna come in and you're gonna dominate with zero hesitation, that's what you're gonna do. He also told me, he says that MMA training may be hard, but it's nothing like what I did in the service. Absolutely, this guy's a Marine, that means he's tough right out the gates. That's something I don't think I could ever do. Uh, probably the reason why I'm sitting here instead of uh, doing something important, you know what I mean, Jeremy? <laughs> That I do. Look for Thomas Thatcher to put the pressure on. He told me that this is all about volume of punches, and he also wants to stop the takedown. Thatcher likes to fight the stand-up war. Making his way to the cage, it is Joe Perry. Now talking about layoffs, Perry has not stepped in the cage since 2014. But he says that in that time, he was training, he was living life. He says that he's back and that none of this as far as the cage rust is gonna matter. I know that you've never done a big layoff in your career. A lot of guys say it, it isn't real. But until you get punched in the face for that first time in real combat, it's got to mean something. Uh, it, it might mean a little bit of something, but here's the deal, man, is if, he, if he's been off for five years from competing, he's been training the entire time. That's enough. That's, that's some people's entire careers five years. So think of what he could have changed, what he could have improved. We're going to see a, a different Joe Perry coming out this time. As we go to our supplement superstore's tail of the tape, Joe Perry, 47 years old, six foot tall, 143.2 pounds. Thomas Thatcher, 31 years old, five foot nine, 144.8 pounds. It is time for your co-main event, ladies and gentlemen, Jeremy Johnson, along with my partner, UFC veteran Adam Sella. Again, we thank you for joining us on Fight TV. Don't forget to follow live on Twitter at Shamrock underscore FC and on Instagram at Shamrock FC. Let's send this one up to the cage to Stephen Bear to make it. Kansas City, this is your co event of the evening tonight fighting out of uh, the blue corner he stands five feet nine inches tall he weighs in at 144.8 pounds fighting out of lawrence kansas please welcome thomas thatcher 
His opponent tonight fighting from across the cage out of the red corner this evening. He stands six feet tall. He weighs in at 143.2 pounds. Fighting out of Savannah, Georgia, please welcome Joe Perry. Referee Nick Nolte has the call for our co-main event of the evening. Joe Perry in the red tape, Thomas Thatcher in the blue. This fight is three five-minute rounds in the Shamrock FC flyweight division. Both guys look incredible shape, Jeremy. Can't wait to see how this is gonna play out. Perry working the over-under position here. Thomas Thatcher trying to put some pressure. These featherweights are moving. Thatcher making it very uncomfortable, that forearm under the chin and into the neck there. That just makes it very uncomfortable for anybody, especially him being a shorter fighter here. He's got to he's got to figure out some way to, to take that height away. And getting that head under the chin, it makes it just it, it makes it hard to move. It makes it painful. She's uncomfortable, yeah. Thatcher trying to work that body lock here, looking to get the sweep. Nice knee to the body there, though, out of Perry. Thatcher's got that inside trip right there. If he just pulled that leg out and he just switched position there. Big knee to the body out of Thatcher. Not really sure what Thatcher is trying to work for here. It, he, he looks like he's going for the, just a normal double leg takedown right now, but. For a minute there, I thought he was going for almost an Uchimata judo throw, but. Right now, he's just kind of making Perry carry his weight. Yeah, it's kind of, uh, see right there, he's, he's got that inside trip again. If he takes out his left leg and just, and just starts it back. swimming it out, that it, you take a table leg away, he's gonna fall down. Get, see, get these guys fired up, fired up, make sure. Joe Perry looked like he's swimming in for a guillotine right there if he could. Uh, Thatcher trying to lock up those hands, looking for the takedown. Joe Perry, Perry got a nice tight oh, guillotine goodness. right there. That's in there. Jeremy, this fight's over, I'm calling her. Oh, look at that. He's fighting through it. That's nice the Marine move right there. By Thatcher. That's the Marine and Thatcher being tough with the never quit attitude. I thought that choke was in there. It looked like he almost had a power guillotine. Big elbows there out of Perry. So as we've seen some of the judges tonight, this is a tough one to play out because now is Thatcher controlling where the fight takes place. That's your cage control. But Perry's landing the damaging blows. Yeah, I did that that's tricky. Uh, the judges, and they've confused me a little bit this evening. But I would give this fight right now to Thatcher just because he's controlling. Thatcher Joe, trying for the takedown. He, that's, a, that's a very dangerous head and arm throw because you lose and you can give it up your back. Yeah, now Joe Perry's back to his feet right now. Let's see what he's going to do with the, with the stand-up. Big leg kick out of Perry. Oh, he, went, he was tying up that, uh, he was eyeing up that spinning back fist. Just missed. Nice left hook right there. Joe Perry's got to keep that jab in his face. Keep those arms, he's got that distance. The, uh, the reach advantage, got to keep that distance. A lot of body movement here out of Perry. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of shuffling the hands like that. I think it's easy to time and you kind of come over the, over the top with the counter on either side. Thatcher trying to find it there, locking up. Big knee there out of Perry. They said that Joe Perry's 47. Is that his age? I, I don't think he's that old. Well, I mean, still. <laughs> Not that old, but just old. No, he's, he's actually, he's moving around like he's in his 20s right now. Age is just a number, Adam. Age is just a number. Down to under one minute remaining here in the first round of this three round featherweight fight. I like the wrist control right here by Thatcher. Oh, dropped it with a That's body That's a body knee. shot, fight's over, fight's over. <laughs> a 
huge knee wow. to the solar plexus out of Joe Perry. Finishes the fight. Kind of a, uh, at a first glance, it looked like it could have been a low blow the way he reacted. Usually body shots hit you, and there's a small delay for it to kick in, but nice knee by Joe Perry. Beautiful fight by Joe Perry. Great Never missed a step. <laughs> Let's take a look at our instant replay here. Perry shuffling underneath. Gets that underhook. That nice wrist control by Thatcher, though. Right here, they're just working. Nice knee right there, hurt one. Another Steps one back, right big in there. one. Oh, my goodness. And it is clean to yeah. the solar plexus. We didn't really call it or see it that first one. That first one actually kind of stuck it a little bit. A beautiful, let's send this one up to the cage to Stephen Bear to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout has ended four minutes and 13 seconds of round number one. Your winner by TKO out of the red corner this evening, John Perry. Joe Perry, Joe, you have not stepped in this cage since 2014. How good does it feel to be back? I was born for this. <laughs> now that's what you told me yesterday. A beautiful fight. How much did you work those knees and was that how you saw this fight going? No. So tell me what you thought was going to happen. Improvise, adapt, overcome. A beautiful fight. What do you want next? We're going to see you again, right? Yes, another fight. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is your winner, Joe Perry.